bring that in so you can see it. This is a women's Nike Air Max 1 uh, 87 premium. It's a $160 shoe. And I'm going to have to either speed this up because this thing is wrapped up like a mummy. Each shoe is individually wrapped. So that's going to take a second to get them out. So let me cut this. All right, so I cut that so you could get right to the shoe, man. But this joint is nice. $160. And let me read that label real quick. Like I said, Women's Nike Air Max 187 Premium. Uh, the color is grain, rugged orange, plum fog. Style code is FN7200-7200-224. Really rough suede all the way through. I'm gonna show you the medial. I'm gonna drop this down so you can see the medial side. You notice that it has an extra set of laces. And look at how the laces are locked onto that shoe. I can see somebody leaving it exactly like that. The Nike logo on the footbed, completely different than what we've seen before. This is not the tongue. This is a white piece of cardboard to protect the tongue because the tongue will transfer and rub while it's in the box and in transit. But look at the Nike logo on the tongue. It is a full grain suede and I'm moving the camera. But man, this thing is wavy. Um, it, it's, 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 <laughs> I'm stammering because it's easily one of the best looking. I hate this dirty soul though. I'm trying to keep this video quick, but I hate the dirty soul, the old vintage look of the soul. I don't like that. I don't, I wish it was just pure kind of either gray or off-white. I don't like that. I don't like, but I like everything else about the shoes. So I guess I should quit complaining because I, I have to show you these older looking logos on the shoe, that Nike at the, that's debossed into the suede. And I mean, this entire thing is suede. All right, so it's wrapped up the way it was because suede rubs and transfers and it'll rub off and the shoes will kind of rub onto each other. So you don't want that to happen, which is why it's wrapped the way it is. I wanted to make sure you got a good look at this thing because it's called the tan lines. All right, I get it. I get it. The tan lines. Okay, this makes sense now. I'll quit complaining. No more complaining. What do you think about this shoe? I wanted you to get a top down look on it. As a matter of fact, I'll go down like that. I have to take this paper out again. So you can see that tongue. I just want you to see the tongue on here. And the extra set of laces. These are nice. Um, as far as like, you know, resale value and stuff like that, there's no resale value on these shoes anymore which means that you get to buy what you like. And I don't care what, I think that is going to be a definite collector's item. It's women's sizing, but it's definitely going to be a collector's item because that nice hit of kind of rust suede, the tan suede, the lavender, the aqua, the blue here, that's kind of cobalt blue, that gold. These are nice. Nice job, Nike. No complaints on that. Classic. Oh, show you the outsole. And then that's it. Because this is longer than a minute. I'm trying to keep these short. But I'm wrapping this up. I'll see you guys on the next one. What do you think about the tan lines? Those are dope. 160 bucks. See you on the next one. Peace.